Sunday, Sunday. Let's see what you got going on, bro. Carlos Miller, maybe you don't know what you're looking at, so let me tell you what you're looking at. You're looking at a 496 big block Chevy engine that makes 800 horsepower, built by Donk Master himself. You got the serpentine belt set up. You got a turbo 400 transmission, 373 gears, stitched by slick interior, 26 inch custom Ruchi wheels, a 15,000 watt stereo system, vintage AC, Dakota digital dash, LED lights, and of course, you got that beautiful candy purple color. Come on now, get it together. Click the link right now, man. It's on the property. Y'all know what it is, man. City to city, state to state. Yo, look at that. Look at that fast mug right there, bro. Lift up a little bit. Add this a little bit. All right, that's it. Ease it down slow. There you go. Oh, yeah. Get it in there. All right, let's see what the hell detail mess get going on. Clean up Carlos Miller 1973. We will at least start to clean some of the dirt and grime up under it right quick before we put the motor in. There's some of the stuff we've been forgetting to show, but I'm gonna show y'all today. So, <coughs> what you spray on there, man? <laughs> <coughs> hey, he sprayed some straw stuff on there, man. Hey, Los, we gonna clean that thing up, man. But he sprayed some straw so we can get it cleaned up and uh, we can spray it down. All right, we can continue that. We on it. Getting it cleaned up, just the first stage, y'all. After you clean it all, then we're gonna take the inner fenders out, take all the wire and stuff out, then do it. We gotta fresh wash it a couple times, and with that way we cut the grease a couple times. Man, these cars have grease piled up on them for 50 years. But we got detail man so that he's getting it clean. Y'all check him out. Clean it up, clean it up. 73. Y'all already know what it is, man. Make sure y'all click, like, subscribe. Make sure y'all clap, man. Y'all love it. If y'all like the content like this, let me know. Drop a thumbs up. Tell a friend to tell a friend. You know what I'm saying? Get it in. You missed spot. You, you missed spot right there. You missed spot. <laughs> All this is out. Everything out, man. All the way down to the right line. Yeah. Well, that up. Tan it down. See, we already started working on old something tray for Los, Carlos Miller. I right, know what it is. See what he got in the inside. Got an interior in there that been sitting in the trunk. You know, you know he buy people product that they, they couldn't finish and say, hey, don't, man, you can finish that thing for me. So you know what we got to do, man. We're going to put it together over here in and our cousin. we just not inventorying everything, see what they got going on. You know what I'm saying? You got some different color material in some brown or something. Look pretty good. Checking them out. See what we got going on. We got the seat side, the dash done. So y'all know we about to do this thing, right? I'm going to show y'all what we about to do this thing. We about to the Dakota Digital Dash. 
change this to, we're gonna put some 26s on it. You know what I'm saying? If you walk around here, that's what it look like right now. You know what I'm saying? This is what it look like. Came out of Texas, Mississippi. That's what it looking like. We already started to tear down on it. So you know what I'm saying? He already, Jason already did the firewall. He done pulled all the AC stuff out. Like that's what y'all seen in the back right there. Now we about to take the motor mounts off, the control arms, the brakes, the shocks. We about to do everything to it. You know what I'm saying? I'm talking about we about to do everything to it. Like over here what we got, you know, we already got the Viking coilovers. We got the positive traction and gear set right here. Do the, go ahead and do the rear end in it. You know what I mean? We got Vikings on the front and the back. Let me show y'all that, man. Shout out to Viking Pormans. They always come through with us on all the time. So we take that. Let me show y'all what we got. Rest stuff laid out. What, what we got laid out. Let me show you. That's something new. I ain't gonna talk about that. But look, look here. Global West control arms on the bottom. Stainless steel headers. PSI. Shout out to PSI on the wire harness. Brand new brake lines. Up and lower rear control arms. Brand new GM starter. We only use the best stuff on all the cars, as y'all can see. These are proven to do what they got to do. And y'all know the Dakota Digital Dash right there in the plastic. So we pull all the parts out. So we all got, we already got the motor. Shout out to SS Lights, Donald, man, he do his thing. He got the motor here, converter, transmission, and that's it. You know what I'm saying? So motor, transmission, LS swap. We can put the uh, thing on the front, the Vintage AC, CVF, serpentine kit on the front. And uh, we can put this thing together. You know what I'm saying? And plus, we can put a little bit of <laughs> gap sauce with it. You know what I'm saying? QA1 uppers. And we're using some Global West lowers because I just like how, you know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm missing match parts because I just like how they fit. You know what I'm saying? But QA1, QA1, get at me. Let me know what y'all need to do. We got plenty of these cars. You know what I'm saying? Something like this right here. Uh, that, that's in need of all this kind of stuff. So I'm going to go back over to the car and walk through <laughs> car see what y'all got going on like i told y'all we got big brakes big 14 inch bear brakes coming for that up on lower control arms viking coil over shocks going on this one and like i said ls motor like y'all seen all the parts over there we got started to tear down on it let me go around and show y'all how this thing looking you know how this thing looking y'all get a good look at it what it look like now because it will look totally different in a couple days and I mean a couple days. But y'all, if y'all like stuff like this, make sure y'all comment, like, subscribe. Man, drop a comment down at the bottom, man, and tell me what y'all think, what we about to do to this and what's about to go down. Y'all, as y'all can see, we just snatched the gas thing from up under it. You know what I'm saying? See what's going on with it, but we just tore the brake lines off of it. So all that stuff is off the car and ready to go. So let me know what y'all want to see. You know what I'm saying? We on the rack with it. We tan it down, and it's about to be a real live vert chevy riding vert that's what it's about to be all right so y'all let me know what y'all thinking man what y'all thinking what what y'all thinking drop a comment what color y'all think he should paint it man you know what i'm saying i, I know i know carlos man he, he trying to let the fans figure out what they want to do to the car hit the thing and see what he want to do you know what i'm saying he, he wants y'all to paint the car for him design it. he got the interior color brown so see if y'all got something that go with that just put something together put a combination together and carlos go pick it all right so this is what we're doing with y'all, man. This is 73 Vert. We're about to do the thing to it. Make sure when he leave here, he going to be the lead sideways. Okay? You understand what I'm saying? When he leave here, he got to lead sideways, but he got to be able to stop. So all that right there, y'all seeing, that's coming off. Okay? And then while they're looking like this, you know, we got stuff like this is at the shop. You know what I'm saying? Supercharger. You know, you know what I mean? Seven inch lift on the back. You know what I'm saying? Y'all stay tuned for this one because we ain't dropped this one yet. You know, so I'm going to just give you a little look. I would it look like if we still doing the wiring on it. We still doing a little bit of work and stuff on it, getting the AC to working like it should. So, y'all, you know what I'm saying? Y'all stay tuned, man. Comment, like, subscribe on what y'all thinking. All right. Y'all already know what it is. City to city. State to state, boy. You know what it is. Y'all know what's going on, man. Fast and Flashy 8, the original Big Wheel show is going down. September the 10th, Dalton Dragway. 
gates open at 2 p.m. and we race until 12 in the morning, man. Listen, we got the Florida boys coming up there. Two fly DNL, Primo, Rose. They bring all the heavy hitters out of DNL camp, man. Listen, y'all know we got in and out custom up here with the Z06, Black Blur, Rag Dimensions, plus many more, man. We got a big car, truck, and bike show. We got Cadillac on 30s out of Virginia with one of the loudest SUVs in the world. And we got Big Girl Florida sitting on a 34 inch wheel, man. The bag of competition, cash prizes all over the place, man. Let's do it real good. Cash prizes everywhere, man. So come on out and have a good time. Clean that firewall right on up. Oh yeah, see what's going on over here. Get ready to put them parts on them. We on it. On it, dog. On it. All the old stuff off. The new stuff's about to go on. <laughs> 